Hello everyone, I'm Pacifty Cash Gamer, and welcome back to another video on Civilization 6. And today, I want to talk about wonders and if we need more wonders. Now, in Civ 6, there's like a lot of wonders, okay? There, there's like always a ton of them. I have an archipelago game where not a lot of wonders are getting built, and there's just so many of them. And, you know, they all do sort of different things. Uh, some are definitely better than others, but I actually think that the Wonder Game in Civ 6 is very fun. I think that it's a game where I find myself building, um, you know, I have my favorite wonders, but I find myself building more wonders and the wonders are actually doing things. So like, um, this game I noticed, in the beginning of the game, there's wonders that help you in different ways than you would say in the late game. So, for instance, there's the Colossus, right? focus on gold generation but it also gives you an extra trade route which is very important in the beginning of the game now if you put the Colossus at the end of the game you don't really need an extra trade route because it's just more effective to just build a commercial hub district because you probably have that you know or the pyramids give you extra build builder slots right or sorry extra builder actions but then you know, it definitely helps you late game because you don't have to put in those spots for the builder um, actions. But um, early game, I mean, that, that slot that allows you those extra builder actions matters way more. I think it's really fun um, to build wonders in this game because th there's a lot of benefits you get from all sorts of wonders. You know, there's the big wonders that give you massive bonuses like River Valley and Petra where like, you know, you, you build them, or Venetian Arsenal, where you build them and you set yourself up. There's other ones that are kind of specialized, like the Temple of Artemis I almost never build, but eh, sometimes you do, you know, you never really know. But the big thing is, like, in the beginning of the game, the wonders really, really do help you in different ways, whereas in the late game, they help you in more specialized victory ways, you know. Whereas, you know, take, for instance, Rur Valley, right? Lots of production. Um, you combine it with vertical integration and you know, you have massive production. Or Statue of Liberty just straight up gives you two diplomatic victory points, you know? That's a pretty important one. Or you want to go for culture, you build the Eiffel Tower, two plus appeal to all the tiles you own. You know? So there's kind of more specialized effects. There's the one, I don't remember the name of it, but it helps you gain a Caesarean, or it gives you en envoys or envoys and Caesarean status bonuses. So, you know, I think overall the Wonder Game in Civ 6 is pretty good. I almost kind of wish there was more... more Wonders that did what the Ancient Ones do, you know? Like... Like, you know how the Hanging Gardens helps you with food and then Anchor Wat helps you with food? Like, I wish there was more that helped you... Kind of like... Like, if there's a Hanging Gardens and a Hanging Gardens 2.0 and a Hanging Gardens 3.0, like, a modern day Hanging Gardens, right? Like, Hammerdage is a very good example where, as a wonder, all it does is it gives you a bunch of great work slots, but that's pretty important, you know? Whereas, like, you know, it synergizes well with the theater squares, because the theater squares give you great work slots. You have Hammerdage, then you also have Broadway, but that Broadway is kind of like, it reminds me of Hammerdage, but it'd be cool if there was, like, a hammeredage, but earlier in the game, like the way that the Great Library works, where it, it is kind of like an early game hammeredage, where it gives you some extra slots for writing, you know. So that's kind of what I wish. The only thing, really, if they do add even more wonders, because there's a lot of wonders, that they just kind of they do more of like what the ancient ones do, but in the late game. Now I don't know how OP that might be. Really overpowered. They might have tried that already. I don't know. But yeah, guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to leave a comment down below. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I will see you in the next episode, stream, vlog, or Instagram post of whatever I decide to make.